in three, two, one, go. And we're off to a 2v3 match between the Blue Alliance and Red Alliance starting off. The quick shot from Cardinal, getting a cube on the Red Alliance side. One cube on the ground, one cube on the mid for the outer and co-op grid respectively as we exit Teleop and enter, or exit Autonomous and enter Teleop period period. Starting off on the Blue Alliance side, Cardinal with a cube, or with a cone, misses the shot on the outer grid, unfortunately. Over on Red Alliance, Janksters get their first shot, getting a uh, high level cube on the co-op grid. Red Alliance currently has the lead, 20, 30 points to the Blue Alliance's nine. Blue Alliance at a severe disadvantage, both points-wise and robot-wise. Let's see if they can make it back, though. Cardinal, oh, getting a cube stuck in their human player station. Well, they're coming back, lining up their arm. Let's come back to them later. Janksters has a cube in their possession. They're going to try and sneak by Cardinal. And 9-1-11, they do, and get a shot successfully on the top of the outer grid. Well, it looks like Blue Alliance is on their own right now. Cardinal, the lone robot, as 5430 appears to be having some technical issues. That's going to be trouble. Looks like Cardinal is in it to show off instead of winning right now. But in the meantime, Red Alliance is still trying to get as much scoring as possible. 9-1-11 is trying to push the cube into position. It looks like they, are, they don't have a mech right now. 46-69. And Janksters grab a cube from the loading zone. They're heading over to their grid. One more cube to form a link on the ground, but instead they go for a mid-level shop on the outer grid. 39 seconds left. Blue Alliance is still keeping it in the lead, 40 points to 37. Red Alliance has been catching up with just two robots so far. We've entered the end game period. This could come down to end game points, surprisingly enough. Janksters, Warriors of Hephaestus, and Galileo all lining up on the switch as Blue Alliance gets two of their robots on the charging station. Let's see if Red can get three. Looks like they're just sticking with two right now. Janksters and Hephaestus going back and forth. They're still tilting too far. They lock in, no, not quite, zero seconds. And Hephaestus falls off the last second as Janksters slowly slide. With a score of 60 to the Red Alliance's 45. Well done by the Blue Alliance.